creating a smart economy with optimizing the digital world of the future with advantages of blockchain technology. It sounds assertive. Can a blockchain platform do that? NEO theoretically describes its smart economy system as digital assets plus digital identity plus smart contract equals smart economy. I'm Tony from KK Technologies. Let's discover NEO together. NEO's smart economy means enabling the digital identities of people and companies to interact and exchange digital assets all via safe and secure smart contracts. Besides, developers can create a smart contract without learning a new coding language. This makes the NEO network more desirable for developers and thus increases its potential for adoption and growth. Fastest transactions compared to rivals makes NEO incredibly competitive in terms of speed against its rival coins. It can handle over 10,000 transactions per second. Smart contracts allow the execution of transactions and agreements among different parties without governance by any middleman or central mechanism. The execution of such contracts is based on the programming code of the network, and the coding allows traceability, transparency, and irreversibility of transactions. Due to its sharing many similar features, it's also known as Ethereum of China. But, the features which explained above makes us think that it's more efficient than Ethereum. Interoperability. Native oracles. Self-sovereign ID. Decentralized storage. Neo name service. One block finality. Best in class tooling. Smart contracts. Multi-language. More and more. But how? How does Neo work? Neo uses a consensus mechanism method called Delegated Byzantine Fault Tolerant (DBFT). DBFT works similarly to the Delegated Proof of Stake (POS) and leverages a real-time voting system to settle which computers running the software can generate the new block on the blockchain. Thus, anyone who owns Neo can assist operate the network. Each Neo coin can be locked or staked to represent a vote. All owners who stake Neo then vote for the consensus nodes, who are assigned for generating blocks. Each time a new block is generated, users are rewarded with NEO gas. This will continue happening until gas reaches its market cap of 100 million coins. Then holders of NEO will be rewarded with a portion of the transaction fees. The fuel of the network, gas is what will be exchanged as currency inside the ecosystem, and it is what is going to economically incentivize the various projects taking place in it. What is N3? A whole new world. N3 is the latest version of the NEO blockchain. It is an upgrade to the current NEO protocol. N3 improves on previous versions by presenting an improved development experience. Their goal is reaching powerful and complete features, a highly modular architecture, and an enhanced governance and economic model. It offers everything the new developer needs to build their first app through to the power and scalability required by enterprise applications. Beside of the new improvements generated in version N3, certain features are not backwards compatible with the existing NEO legacy blockchain. The NEO blockchain running N3 will coexist alongside the current NEO legacy blockchain for an extended time interval. This will provide users with plentiful opportunities to transfer their tokens and applications to the new chain. At this moment, no action is required on the part of token holders. When the new chain is closer to a mainnet launch, NEO will publish detailed information on how to safely transfer your coins from the legacy to N3 version of NEO. Overall, NEO is a highly promising and rapidly developing cryptocurrency. NEO offers the kind of functionality that proves to be effective in creating smart contracts and forming transactions. NEO's innovative technology and approach to smart contracts are contributing to the advancement of a smart economy, which is paving the way for future developments in the blockchain industry. What are your thoughts about NEO? Would you use or invest in it? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, please tab subscribe button 